All right, welcome back. We left off, we killed the collector. We got his map, and we started collecting his collection of collectibles. And they are delectable collectibles. We are electable. And it is now getting questionable. Where are we going? What are we doing? We have no idea. We're off to see the wizard. We don't even need to see the Wizard of Oz. We've got our heart. We've got our brain. We had courage from the start. <sighs> we are collecting grubbles. We also beat Fluke Mom. And we got the Flukey Fluke. Fluke Nest. Living Charm. Born in the gut of a Fluke Marm. Transforms the Vengeful Spirit spell into a horde of volatile baby flukes. And it does so much more. It's the most broken part of this game. And I always save it for last because I don't like the flukes. <laughs> They're like way they attack at you. It just makes me all uncomfortable. There's a, a grubble over here that we keep missing. Why don't we have a compass? I'm still in battle mode from Luke Mom. Uncomfortable. Oh, I don't have any soul juice. I was like, why is it not shooting? Hi, baby. You're not a high baby. You're a false grub. I haven't seen one of you in a while. Or ever, actually. That was terrible. That was scarifying. There he is. My real grub. That's so funny because usually I dance on him too and he's the one I didn't dance with until he went under and I ran away from and he was the one that's actually an evil one. The odds of that are so slim. Okay. Let's revamp our charms really quick. And then where are we going? Because that gets us these ones. Oh, we should have just gone another Crystal Peak one. Green Pass one, they're done. There's one over there by Deep Nesty. There's three in this bottom left corner. one in the crystal peak corner. We should have just stayed up there. My bad. So we'll get the one in the crystal peak and then we'll go down and get the other three. And we'll get Nosk and then the last pale of over there. And then I think we can just... No, because we got to farm a bunch of Gyo to do that. I don't know if we ever even need to upgrade the Dale. We've been running with the old nail the whole time. We've been almost a whole game with it. See? Old nail. Traditional weapon of hollow nest. Its blade is blunt with age and wear. And it's good enough to kill every punk we've come across so far.
remember when I first played this game, getting through this part was a challenge. Like, it was so hard to just move through this part. And this part is just a... Like a... An easy pathway. Like, it's like a... Oh, instead of having to go the hard way, go this way. But man, the first time I was just like, I can't do it. The jumping, the grabbing, the timing is so hard. And now I can do it. Like, it's no problem. I can do it all lickety-spitty. See, I thought we already got these grubs. Oh, there's that's right. There's one up here that you needed uh, the mantis wings for, and I didn't have the mantis wings at the time. And we still have to fight Crystal Guardian. Oop. Still here with you. Okay. Now we can head into Deep Nest. I don't know if we're going to go there. Alright, because that's everybody. There's just those three. So we're obviously going to have to go into the Queen Station route. Oh, there's four. I didn't see that one right there. There's a Queen Station the route's right there next to all of them. So this is gonna be a little, little long trek. <clears throat> These ones are kind of out of the way. That's why I was saving them for the end. Because they're three really long, really far away from each other ones. To get to each one, each one has to be gone to in its own respective way. Oops, and they're all on the same side of the map too. So, or at least in the same corner of the map. Why does this one always get me? How do I... Every time. Go oh, all the way through the Mantis Village for that one. Okay, that's going to be the last one then. I just always forget to open that doorway every time I'm in the Mantis Village.
So somewhere around here, there should be a Grubbalub. Ba dub dub. But I was terrified every time I was running through here, so I didn't spend a lot of time looking, listening, or paying attention. Right there. I mean, it's easy when you have a map being like there's a grub off in the space over here. You're a big grub. Big grubs are aggressive. Three fake grubs. And then the other one's all the way down to the left anyhow, but I think we have to get to him through a different way. But it's still all the way down to the left. Mm -hmm. It does look like it's right there. I was just like lucky the way that fell worked. And then I hit two other people. It was like, no, 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 no. You don't get to fall through all of that. Not taking any damage. That was crazy. Not this time. Yay. Just in case I die in the Nosk fight. Because since we're here, we're going to have to fight him. He's like one of the last people we got to get battles with. I don't know, there might be more. Why are those steps there? I was going to lead to nothing. I think that leads to the Nosk, right? Yep. Yay! It's creepy when there's like a replica of yourself. It's nothing but a walk to him. One guy.
So when I come back the next time, I can just go that way. Spell twister on. I just got to blast him and then dodge and let our girls do the work. For the sake of not having to come back here a bunch of times. guy's gonna get me any. Yep. Now we have to come back down here because I died. Tram's just to the right. We could put a dream gate there. He's just right here. Okay, Mr. Noski guy. Man. Sharp Shadow might be helpful against him. One more try and then we'll move on. He's not super hard to get to. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm stuck on that ledge. He just spammed us really hard from the beginning there. I think we can get him. Got to be a trick to him.
Oh my gosh, just come here, boy. Okay. Back to catching our grubs. Because he's just a pale or we don't use pale or right now anyways. I think Sharp Shadow is the trick to him, though. But just don't want to waste a bunch of time. now our next girl would be quicker to go this way. So just done that from the get go. Should have gone to grab myself some water. That's a silly boy. It's the distant village one. stuff. Tastes like success. Open a pop bomb. What? <clears throat> Greetings, you are very tired. Sit and rest. We are friends. Welcome. Sit and rest. Yeah, that's what happened. The first time I played, please sit and rest. <gasps> it's warm and safe. Sit and rest. Welcome. You need rest. Sit and rest. No. Trust you. I'm here for a grub. And if the grub is in there, I'm going to be most unhappy. Who's our homeboys? Hmm, came. The red flag. The red flame I've gathered from this dead kingdom. You would claim it for our master for his final act? The ritual plays itself out once more. We are like the notes in an old, old song. You and me, hmm. Endless repeating songs of sacrifice, of servitude, for the ritual, for the troop, for the master. Even this child was born into invisible chains, hmm. So we serve, thus it has ever been, yes. Take the flame, then. It is why you came here. It is done, and yet... It is not merely by fortune that we meet here, in the darkest, furthest reaches of the world, where my master's eye scarlet eyes cannot see us. Mm, a song that never ends is no song at all. You take part in the ritual, yet I sense you truly have no master. Is it so? Perhaps together we can banish that livid flame, and let this dead kingdom rest in peace. If you wish to silence the endless song, mm, meet me where it began. But if you return to the master and complete the ritual, mm, as long as you do it without regret, I will bear you no hatred. Which is what we're going to do. We're going to banish him this time, because last time we didn't. Do I have to get captured by these people to get the grub? That sounds disgusting, but I think I do. Because there seems to be no other thing around here. 
That's grubbish. Grubby. Crap, tell me they're gonna get me. No, I'm dead. Game over. Gotta restart the whole thing. Now I'm in the beats den. The beats by Dre. Oh, beast. The beast's den. The beast by Ashante. Get out of my face with your face. He hurt me. Should have shot him one more time, it would have cost me my soul. See that guy. Another rancid egg. We're gonna be ever closer to the grubby grub. You can hear him now. Grubs? Is this that fungal waste one, yeah? I'm gonna have to get into it from. Probably the City of Tears, which is where our thing is, anyways. Oh, don't you do that to me.
Oh, there's just different ways to get this. To get here. A sleeping figure lays atop a stone plinth. Bound for brood. For child. There's two dreamers down. Oh yeah, gotta focus them in. Gotta slurp them up. Yeah, this is the one that was her mom. So you've slain the beast, and you were to head toward that fated goal. I'd not have obstructed this happening, but it caused me some pain to knowingly stand idle. What? You might think me stern, but I'm not completely cold. We do not choose our mothers, or the circumstances into which we are born. Despite all the ills of this world, I'm thankful for the life she granted to me. It's quite a debt I owed. Only in allowing her to pass and taking the burden of the future in her stead can I begin to repay it. She's so badass. Leave me now, ghost. Allow me a moment alone before this bedchamber becomes forever a shrine. Mother, forgive my inaction, but another path may be possible. No, give me my money. I need all of the money. Right, how do we get out of here? Dropped. I think it's cool. I can't remember how to get out of there. What? Ooh, did she kill all those people? I want to be 
be pimping like that. The exit was just right there. All right. No. Bad. No listener. Where did we decide we were going? King Station? City of Tears. Oh man, we're almost there. We got... I don't know. Um, one grub left. And then it's into the abyss. Not the abyss. It's into the dream kingdom. We're almost done. Into how do we get there? Yeah, okay. <sighs> well, I wonder if I can go back this way if the door is going to be locked. Yeah, the door's locked. This is also that door we need to open. And then we'll never, never use it again. We'll have finally open this quick access path and then we'll never need it. Grub, number 40. I don't even know how many there are. There's 40 charms. What was that? How did we just fall through the floor right there? And we can't go back up it. That was weird. Mission accomplished. Got all the grubs, which means now we have all the charms. Which means we can get Salubra's blessing, which will be even more helpful for doing the White Palace. On top of having Blubberfleece allergy. The Salubra's Blessing makes it to where when you sit on a bench, all your souls replenished. 
I need to find where all the masks are too, because we should have or the soul vessels. We should be there. All of them, all the way in the background too. the switch can handle this. Let's see how much money that is. Oh, $4,000. And a piece of Paylor. And Gripper Flies Elegy. And a King's Idol. Now we're done with all the grubs. Which is nice. And we've completed all of our tasks list for this stream. So now we are in free territory. Do whatever we want. But we do have $11,000, which is far too much money to be running around with. So we're going to go spend that really fast. Actually, I think we should go to Snoober first. Because you can get to her. In the resting grounds. Easier than the other way, I think. No, because I can shoot. Since I came back and I opened that up. <sighs> we got time. This is the quick way to her. Ooh. Again we meet, my short friend. Here at last I feel at peace. Twice I've seen this world, and through my service have it stripped. The first experience from me, I'm thankful I could witness its beauty again. Hollinest is a vast and wondrous thing, but with as many wonders as it holds, I've seen none quite so as intriguing as you. Ah, my flattery returns only silent stoicism. I like that. I like that very much. Incredible. Call the witness achievement. the king's charm doesn't count as a charm it's only half a charm because then you can't use her thing to get through the white kingdom easier that makes sense whatever that's fine Yeah. 
we'll just go to Dirt Mouth to spend our money because she's only 800 bucks, so that's nothing. That's literally like one trip of a farm. Banishing is going to be the very last thing we do. Both because if you banish the troop, you lose access to the ability to do these charm things. So, like, you have to do those before you banish her. If you do the Nightmare Grim fight, Instead of the banishing, she'll stay here until you have, have as long as you want to do it. <clears throat> oh, I can smell it. Another gift made for me. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give fragile greed. Yes. Oh, such a little beauty. Such a smell. Such a smell. Oh. Oh, so good. So tasty. A perfect, perfect thing. Just for me. Again, you're so greedy for gifts, poor little lovely. Give me your geo and I'll give you your gift. Nine thousand dollars? Yeah, sure. That brings us back down to a nice 2,200. And then we have unbreakable greed. Which is the most poopy looking charm of all the charms that look like poop. So, Unbreakable Greed causes the bearer to find more Gia when defeating enemies. This charm is unbreakable. Strengthens the bearer, increasing the damage they deal to their enemies with their nails. Charm is fragile and will break. That's the next one we need to give her and get money for. I think it's like 1200 for that one too, or 1500, it's a ridiculously large number. For fragile strength. But we'll get it. I think movement speed charms will also be less than beneficiary. I mean, we'll get rid of that and we'll get rid of Grimchild. I have to get rid of Shaman Stone too. Should be able to slow cheese our way through, even taking the path of pain if we wanted to. There's no map for this area.
Well, that was a bit difficult. Not off to a great start, but I don't think we have to kill him twice. There's not many enemies in here. Might, yeah, I might not be able to do this with the Weaverlings. Because they attack stuff. And that's counterproductive. Do some dancing so long nail is going to be the way to go. So we have no aids. We have no map. We have no idea what we're doing. So pretty. I think we're taking the peaceful route. Nope. Oh man. Oof. scary <laughs> well this is what I mean by being able to build soul with hive blood because you get way more with the allergy and grub song when you get hurt it goes from being like 8 soul to being 25 soul Now we're maxed on soul. Oops. Ah. 
Wasn't there the bench was around here somewhere? Oh, I was on that one. I thought I was at least. There it is. So we're going to save here because we already got the elevator up to the next section. I don't know if that's Path of Pain or not, so i got to look at a map on which way I'm supposed to go for the, the quick easy way and which way is the real hard way. Because I ended up going the real hard way the first time too, so I already have that achievement. But we just got to get the King's Idol and then we get the Salabra and then uh, we're dunsies. We're killing dreamers and doing God home and finding which bosses we missed him. Where the third soul container is. Anyways. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you all have a wonderful night.